Hi, I'm Graham Steele, CEO and founder of CryptoSense, and in this video, we're going to talk about using hardware security modules securely. Hardware security modules, or HSMs, are special purpose computers that protect the most sensitive keys in an organization and use them to provide cryptographic services. Typically, they have a FIPS or Common Criteria certification that gives some indication of security. But like every part of cryptography, you have to use them exactly right to get security that you need. In this demo, I'll show you how the CryptoSense Analyzer platform takes care of this for any HSM using the standard PKCS11 interface. HSM security relies on two things, making sure the keys inside the HSM have the right protection and that the application is using them to do cryptography in the right way. First, let's look at key protection. Here we're using the CryptoSense software to fuzz test the HSM in its as live setup to find out exactly what it will let us do. It's important to understand that every PKCS11 HSM's interface is different in small details that make certain attacks possible or not. And each HSM can be configured in different ways which can affect how the keys are protected. The CryptoSense PKCS11 fuzzer is the state-of-the-art tool for automated testing of an HSM interface. Fuzzer creates a trace of calls and results. Uh, we're gonna upload the resulting trace to the CryptoSense Analyzer platform to find out exactly what particular keys this HSM will allow to be extracted using all the available operations in any combination. So here we can see that this particular HSM allows a well-known attack where keys are allowed to both wrap other keys and decrypt ciphertext. The tool gives references so you can understand the full implications of the attack and where it's come from. So we know this HSM allows some keys to be attacked, but the million dollar question is, does my application actually use any keys that can be extracted? You can find that out using the CryptoSense PKCS11 tracer, which intercepts calls to the HSM and logs their details for analysis. Here I'm gonna launch a simple application and I'm setting an environment variable to activate the CryptoSense tracer. And again, I'm uploading that resulting trace to the analyzer platform uh, where I can look at the report. So we can see a summary of the cryptography that's been used, and now we're going to look at all the keys this application uses. So here there's just one. Um, what we want to know is, could this key be extracted? So we can cross-reference this to the results of an HSM scan. Now we can see that this key can in fact be extracted, and to find out how, I can follow a link to see the details of the vulnerability that could be exploited to obtain the key, and it's our famous wrap and decrypt vulnerability. To fix this, we could iterate on the HSM configuration or make changes in the PKCS11 attributes the application is assigning to this key, and then we can go ahead and test again. Now let's look at the use of cryptography. So thanks to our vulnerability analysis engine, we can work out where your application is using cryptography insecurely or out of compliance with your cryptography policy that you can customize in the tool. Here we can see that the application is making a basic error using ECB mode for encryption. All of this can be built into CI CD pipelines to become part of automated testing so that we can be sure that HSMs are always used securely and changes to the application never compromise an important key. We can use the CryptoSense reports to show auditors, regulators, and customers that everything is secure. They can also unblock the path to adopting new devices like cloud HSMs. This is just a taste of what CryptoSense Analyzer platform can do to help secure the use of cryptography. For a full demo, get in touch for an appointment or take a look at some of our other videos to find a little more. Thank mm -hmm. you.